With 160 million hectares of forest, it's no wonder Canada has the world's largest forest product tree. However, this industry inevitably creates a lot of wood waste. This biomass must be properly dealt with if Quebec wants to rely less on fossil fuels. Fortunately, there exists a carbonization process called pyrolysis, which effectively transforms this biomass into a green source of energy, biocoal. A company from Quebec, Erex Energy, has developed a technology which perform this process in three seconds instead of half an hour for similar technologies. That's a fast reply to the 35 million tons of coal burned each year in the country. So don't blink, it's right here. Sylvain, we are here in your new plant in Bécancourt. What's going on here? So it's the first biocoal plant in Canada. At full capacity, the plant can produce two tons per hour of biocoal pellets, which is a lot. We do the whole process from biomass conditioning to biocoal pellets. I want to see that. Let's go. We uh, receive and uh, unload the trucks here in the dome. The material is then ground and dried using the hot air from the uh, pneumatic conveying system while it is transported to a third silo. The biomass is then ready to be carbonized, a process that we call torrefaction. The biomass is first heated inside a conditioning chamber before it is injected inside the cyclonic reactors where it will be in direct contact with the hot gases coming from the combustion chamber. It is in the cyclonic reactors that we achieve the torrefaction process. We transform the biomass into biocoal. After the biocoal is cooled down inside a conveyor which is equipped with water misting nozzles before it is densified into pellets. We densify the biocoal into pellets to maximize its density and minimize the shipping cost to the customers. Air extorifaction is a continuous process. Most of the competition have a batch process. It takes a lot more time, several minutes to several hours, versus Airx process that takes only a few seconds. Next destination for this biocoal? So the biocoal pellets will be used to replace coal in power plant, in cement plant, and in some metallurgical application. Life cycle analysis show a GHG reduction of between 70% to 95%. The biocoal in powder that we call biochar will be used as a soil amendment in agriculture and also for soil remediation. In 10 years, the global wood pellet demand is expected to reach 25 million tons per year and the technologies which produce them are taking center stage. The new black gold is actually green. <laughs>